Hello, thanks for joining us. I'm Anna Manuel. Members of the U.S. congressional delegation stopped by the Queen City for a meeting with local leaders and business owners today. A key discussion was about improvements happening around East Mississippi. Twin States News' Jacob Roby found out what that could mean for the city of Meridian and its residents. Having a chance to speak with state senators and Congress about impacting the community is not something that happens every day. So as the city of Meridian had the chance to speak with U.S. congressional delegation, one topic that was discussed was wastewater improvement. On the Energy Committee, we brought to Meridian $10 million from Army Corps section, the 219 section, to support construction of wastewater improvements for the city of Meridian, $10 million was just delivered. Public Works Director David Hodge expressed what that means for the city and how it will affect residents. These funds will be used um, for two different pipe sewer lines, one on the west side of town, one on the east side of town. So um, it's going gonna, it's gonna to go a long way to help us get our, our sewer pipes rehabbed, replaced, and where they're functional and where they can support growth for the city of Meridian. He also emphasized the need for improvements and the significance the funds will help make. Because we've disinvested in our sewer system through the years, deferred maintenance, and so now we're actually trying to catch up for lost time. And so there's a, um, there's a big program. We're expecting at least $200 million over, over the next um, 10 to 15 years, maybe more. Today's special meeting with the full Congress delegation served as a way for business people and leaders to come out and talk about things affecting Meridian and East Mississippi. In Meridian, Jacob Osroby, Twin States News.